Hey guys, welcome to our channel. Before starting the video, if you have not subscribed our channel till now, then please subscribe it. In this video, we will see what is MVC annotation driven tag in Spring. Spring 3 introduces an MVC XML configuration namespace that simplifies the setup of Spring MVC inside your web application. If you don't include MVC annotation driven tag then also your MVC application would work. If you have used the context component scan for creating the beans or defined the beans in your XML file. MVC annotation driven does some extra job on configuring the special beans that would not have been configured if you are not using this element in your XML file. This tag would register the handler mapping and handler adapter required to dispatch requests to your controllers. Let's implement. Let's run and see before MVC annotation driven tag what is the output. Let's copy this keep it in notepad so later can compare. Now let's add MVC annotation driven tag in Spring Surf LaTeX ML file. Need to add the namespace so let's copy from up and change up to MVC. After change MOSA over, if link it valid then below the line will come. It's coming means it's valid. Let's add the desired tag. See that's it. Let's run. After MVC annotation driven tag in the XML output. See it ran successfully. Let's copy this and paste it in notepad. Let's compare both the output. Initialization started and after that all XML related log is common. URL path is coming different. Previous default annotation handler mapping and after request mapping handler mapping. I hope it helps you to remember the difference. I hope you like this video then please subscribe our channel.